Alrighty. <laughs> All right, hi everyone. Uh, this is Brad from Board Game Geek, and we're talking with Isaac, uh, designer of City of Remnants. Yeah, maybe you could just uh, give us a quick walkthrough through the game about how and how it plays. Yeah, so this is City of Remnants. Um, what you're going to be doing in City of Remnants is that you're going to be playing as gangs that have been thrown onto this kind of refugee planet by the Yugai, which is this evil overlord race that has taken over your planet, and you're pretty much the remnants of what has been left over of your civilization. All right? So you're going to be choosing one gang. Uh, each gang is going to have a different starting deck that is going to show you a different play style with each deck. Um, right here we have the yellow deck. Um, what they do is that they're going to be able to recruit units into their gang very easily and cycle through their deck. We have the green deck, who's very good at gaining money and being having money is going to allow you to take any way to victory you choose. We have the blue deck that's very good at building developments. Developments are good because they allow you to gain renown, which is the victory points of the game. Building developments onto the map that's going to allow you to get more victory points and take over different things. You also have the red deck, who's very aggressive. If you're an aggressive player, that's the guy you want to be. Because he's going to be able to kick down doors, kill the you guys that are going to be coming down at the end of each round and taking down people that are on the map. All right? What you're trying to do is you're trying to gain renown throughout the game. Once all the renown is gone, whoever has the most renown is the victor, and the game ends. Awesome. Sounds pretty cool. Um, are there plans for future uh, factions to kind of battle it out in this city? As long as the game is, is done well, um, I have already built an expansion for the game that's going to be releasing uh, four different starting decks. Um, they're all going to be in the same color, so you can go ahead and choose which one you want to start with, as well as additional gang members and additional black market cards that you can purchase. Great. Um, and I know it's available for sale at the show. Is it also available in retailers already, or that, will that be coming down the line? They should all be in retails, uh, retail stores by April 10th. Um, you can also go to our website, platthatgames.com, and check them out. Awesome, thank you. And I know this is your first game. Are we going to see future games from you as well? Actually, yes. Um, we've already announced the fact that I am the designer for Bioshock Infinite, um, which is hopefully going to be um, at Gen Con, and um, we might be able, even able to release it a little bit earlier than that. I also have another game that's signed by Plaid Hat Games, um, but we're not talking about that one yet, um, so keep tunes. Uh, you can go ahead and check out my Twitter at IsaacVegaDesign.com, and you can check out our website for more information on that. All right, thank you very much. It's great to talk to you. Thank you guys. No problem.